Welcome back. You're with us on Closing Bell, and we are uh, looking at the next set of stocks that are making it to the headlines today. Gale has been trading higher. Sonal is standing by with the details on the up move. Sonal, I know there's been a lot of chatter around this potential tariff revision for Gale, right? What's the latest? Uh, the latest is that today is the day when there will be an open house where uh, the participants, the stakeholders, all of them will come together and finalize the tariff rate as well. There are consultations which will continue. And just after this, uh, we will get the final rate of tariff as well. So today is a, an important day in terms of the tariff hike uh, timeline as well. Uh, now, uh, we have been pointing out how uh, PNGRB said that they are looking at $60.9 per MMBTU as the uh, final tariff in terms of unified pipeline. And we do have some of broker which have come out with notes as well. Jeffrey says that proposed tariff could raise standalone EBITDA by 15%. So they are very positive and this hike is much higher than what they had anticipated. Uh, Post-tax ROCE will remain at 5%, ruling out large multiple expansions and fair value for the stock would rise to 110 if proposed tariff is finalized. They have a target price of 90 rupees per share right now. CLSA has also come out with a note. They have a buy rating with a target price of 125 rupees per share. Indication, of course, raises hopes a according to them, of a 50% hike that will come through. Final tariff order is likely any time after today. And they are modeling a 40% hike, while 52% hike would boost FI24 EPAs by 7% for the company. A uh, higher share of stable utilities earnings would also drive a re-rating. So a lot of macros also in favor of Gale right now in terms of lower gas prices, pet care margins. They, are, they have bottomed out in quarter four. All of them are working for Gale. Additionally, this uh, tariff hike would come in as the other kicker for the company.